So, uh, good evening. For those of you who are following my videos fervently, uh, I'm obviously in a different setting. I'm in England, uh, the UK, as they call it here. Uh, just did a class called Time and Money, which we'll talk about in just a minute. Oh, look at that shiny little thing on my forehead. Yeah, uh, That's a phrase my grandmother used to use, but uh, I'm not going to go there. And I'm sitting in, a, in an office, in a, an acupuncturist's office. It's the evening, obviously. I don't know if you can see, but it's dark outside. And it's chilly, and it's chilly in the office because the Brits close off sections of their homes and they keep the doors closed because electricity is really expensive here. And it's probably nuclear produced, which we all know is green and safe. And uh, only the United States of America, after uh, the Japanese thing, would be thinking, oh my God, I think we need more nuclear reactors. You know, let's take the taxpayers' dollars, we haven't built them for enough, and then we'll put it into nuclear energy. What do you say, Bob? Well, isn't nuclear energy like, like thousands of years before the residue goes away? That's not really green. Well, it's green for this generation, right? It's not green for the next generation. But I'm, I'm uh, traveling over, all over England, not all over England, but I'm going to go up and see a friend of mine named Dave. I'm not going to say his last name because uh, Dave is a builder. Builder Dave, not Builder Bob, Builder Dave. And the last time I was there, I talked to Dave about Nikola Tesla, T-E-S-L-A. Um, and he has a, a past. Of course, he's dead, but he was a brilliant innovator and inventor. And he claimed that you can pull electricity out of the ethers. Right? And he built this generator. And you can go online, by God, and look and see if you can find and build one of these things. And they say, yes, it's easy to build one of these things. That's if you know which end of the screwdriver to use, which I do, but other than that, I'm not really innovative. So the last time I was with Dave, we got talking about Nikola Tesla, and he said, who is that? And we talked about it. And uh, I left him the plans that I had uh, purchased on building one of these things. So I'm really excited to see. Because the thing is, if each house had a, ne a Tesla generator on it, apparently we could do away with nuclear energy. If we had... Uh, the diesel generators running with plant fuel, we could have diesel generators running with renewable fuel. Hmm, how thoughtful. Now, I come from a base of cynicism or skepticism, right? Because I was a chiropractor, I still am a chiropractor, I still have my degree, I still practice uh, somewhat. And uh, I have found that the powers that be don't know what they're talking about. In fact, they lie. They lie a lot. And they say that chiropractic is dangerous, and it's not. Uh, they say that it causes strokes, which it doesn't. But every eight years, they come out with this whole, <gasps> oh my God, right? But it's so easy to scare the American people that they believe it. Chiropractic works. I know it works. I have six great kids, and I'm going to talk about them in just a minute. Sorry about the shaky screen. I'm on a table I'm not used to. Talk to you soon. M-I-C, www.micpeakperformance.com.